Hello, my dear remarkable kids. In today's lesson, we are going to talk about addition. Have you heard this word before? We can think of addition as the idea of adding, joining, or combining. For example, when we prepare food following a recipe, it uses the following words. Let us look at them taken from part of the recipe for my favorite cookie. Pour 100 grams of flour. Add one spoon of margarine. Mix in a cup of milk. Add two eggs. When we group, mix or join all the ingredients, we have these amounts added together in one single place. This is what addition in everyday mathematics is like. Let me give you an example of how it works. If I take two red pencils, here's one, two, and three blue pencils, one, two, three. And then I group together all the red pencils and all the blue pencils. I will have one, two, three, four, five pencils in total. The symbol we use to represent addition is the plus sign. This sign originates from the word et, used in a very old language called Latin, and it means and. In the process of addition, we also use the equality sign, or equal sign, to say that one thing or quantity is equal to or equivalent to another. Guys, do you remember those pencils I set apart? Look, here they are again. <laughs> two red pencils plus three blue pencils equals one, two, three, four, five pencils. So now our addition looks like this. Two plus three equals five. As you can see, we can use addition in many situations in our daily lives. Now that you know what addition means, in the next class, I will teach you different ways to perform additions. See you soon! Bye-bye!